Just gonna hit you in the head. <laughs> Wait, I need to explain what this is. It's so um hectic. So, for the past seven weeks, I've been attending my antenatal classes. Naz has been going to every single class. He came to every single one. And basically, they're everything to do with your pregnancy, labor, after baby. They're just a helping hand. They're completely free. They're run by Monique and Natasha and also Tessa is there. And they're three wonderful women who just support you in your pregnancy and blah 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 um lots of mums came we're all under 24 it was really really good i made some friends like it was just a really good experience um and you learn so so much but basically at the end of the class you were given a baby box which is the baby start box and that's what i'm going to be showing you guys what i got today um i'm going to leave the information about these classes down in the description below um, because if you live in Whangarei and you are expecting a baby, I definitely would recommend going to these classes, especially if you are a young mummy, if you're a teen mom or anything, we honestly need the extra support because obviously it's an unplanned baby, we need the support. So yeah, this is the box that you get when you graduate and it says this box belongs to Christine and Naz. Because Naz came to every single one of my classes. So firstly, I'm going to thank Tessa, who got all the mummies and dads a gift. So Nazareth got a Lynx body spray kit, such a classic Christmas gift, um, which was so sweet of her. She went out and got it herself. And then she also got us money, um, like this little kit of makeup. What the heck? And then um, a conditioner. <laughs> so. So, so sweet. And here's my little booklet. So every single week we would fill out um, just information about baby, which I'm so glad I have this because I want to go through this with you guys in another video. But it's just like heaps of information, what we want and stuff. And it was seven weeks worth. So this is all our little classwork. Okay, so today we got this. Today, this week is safe sleep week in New Zealand. And we got given this little onesie that just says safe sleep day, which is so, so cute. Um, and it's just all about, you know, sleeping safe with your baby. So first things first is this little box inside of it. So freaking much surprise, straight up. Our baby was gifted. The Skin Safe Baby Wipes, which is so good. What the heck? Um, just add H2O chemical free dry wipes. So these are dry ones and you just wet them and then you can use them on, um, you can use them as a nappy liner, wet them for just cleansing baby's delicate areas, face and body. So cool. There's 50 in here by the looks. Then you got given some reusable breast pads. I have so many of these and honestly, you honestly need a lot. And I love that they're reusable. These ones are the microfiber ones. Um, I think I have bamboo ones, and then, I don't actually know which ones the ones are from Little Moody. But, yeah, so you got that. And then, the Wonky Donkey Baby Book, which is so good, it even includes a CD. What the heck? So, a little Wonky Donkey book, and then, given some gauze muslin washcloths, which is going to be so, so good, because I might make reusable wipes out of these for baby's diaper changing just because the muslin ones muslin ones are really like just good for making your own wipes with that's like what keeps coming up whenever i watch those videos i'm just gonna create the lighting oh, everything's beautiful i'm so excited to have my baby then i got the eco store baby nephew balm from them which is a little bit of a bummer because this one it does not work with reusable nappies i bought this myself a while ago but this is not good with reusable nappies. So I'll use it in the beginning. Um, if he ever gets nappy rash, I will use it with um, compostable biodegradable nappies. But I am wanting to use reusable. So if not, I'll have to gift it on to another mama. And then you got a little toy. This one's so cute. Naz is back. I got, what actually is this? Oh, it's a laundry soaker and stain remover. Laundry powder and 
um, stain remover soak thing. Ultra sensitive. I already use ultra sensitive because I'm an ultra sensitive gal. I just want to show you guys how this is packaged. Very freaking cute. Oh, there's nappies. Yay, I'm so excited. I'm going to finish organizing his stuff. These are the newborn Huggies nappies. I don't know why the lighting keeps doing this. And this is a 28 pack for newborn, which I will put into his little organization thing. He gave some maternity pads for me, because I'm gonna bleed like a madman. This is the wool babe sleeping bag, zero to nine months. That's a long time. This is made with breathable merino wool and organic cotton. Naturally temperature regulating and odor resistant. Free room thermometer with dressing guide. What? So it's like, what is this? Very cute. It's striped. I love stripes. So this is like a sleeping bag for babies. Okay, and then he got massive socks. These socks are huge. What size are these? Three to six. These are newborn to three month socks. They look cute. Look how big these socks are. This is a new one apparently. And then they gave some pants. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. What the heck? Look at these drop crotch pants. <laughs> some drop crotch pants for your baby. These are zero to three months. And then they gave these ones. Oh my God, I love these ones. Three to six months, drop crotch, pants. And these are like a blue color, like a sagey blue. And then a little hat, this is by the same brand. This is zero to three months. Little bodysuit, zero to three months. And these are made with merino by the feel. And then a shirt, three to six months. Some onesies, these are zero to three as well. <laughs> they look so massive. Lighthouses all over it. And this one's foxes. And moons. A little sleep suit thing and a zipper one that goes all the way down to the feet which is so so good. Oh yay another sleeping gown. So I only have one of these and this one's in the size zero to three months too. So I got two little sleeping gowns. These are really good to like knot up when your baby is having to sleep and it's like easy diaper change and stuff. And more freaking stuff. A uh, merino bound wrap. What's this? Oh sheets. And another wrap, this one's a muslin one. And it's got the foxes on it again, too. And then lastly, there's a towel, which is so nice, which is so good, because I actually needed one more hooded towel. But inside is a bed as well. So this is like a real little bed for baby to like sleep in. Like if you wanted to like take him places to other people's houses or stuff, you can just like pick up the box baby can sleep in there or if you want him to sleep in there because you don't have a cot you can do that too um and i just wanted to pop in and say how incredibly thankful i am for the birth classes that were available to me they were every single wednesday 10 30 to like 1 30 and they were completely free and then at the end you were given a box of goodies for turning up to every single class and that's just insane i'm so grateful for the resources that I have available to me in this town. Like next week I'm going to a Te Wananga, which is a Maori spiritual pregnancy journey where you, it's free, you get fed and you learn a lot and you connect with people and you connect with your pregnancy and yeah, etc. Um, so it's all been really, really cool and I'm just grateful for the amount of support that I have from my friends, my family, my baby's dad, his family, the community, the internet, everyone. Like, yeah, it's just, I get a lot of help and I'm genuinely really grateful for it. And I just wanted to say that and yeah. Hey guys, so I'm doing some Christmas gift wrapping and I've got these countdown bags. And I'm just going to wrap them up, plastic free, re reusing some countdown bags, um, instead of, you know, taking them away or using them for groceries. So I have this little box here, 
I'm going to put the prezzies in here because they fit in here. Wrap this box in the paper. Just recycled goodies. Yay, I love them. Ooh, another one down. I just finished my first time hand expressing my colostrum. Been given the go ahead. I'm over 34 weeks, almost 35, and I'm allowed to start expressing and storing my colostrum for my baby so that Naz can do some feeding, um, you know, when we're in the hospital, especially on the second night. It can be really hard so Naz can feed his baby instead of just me doing everything which is so nice for both of us um but holy heck that was difficult to get the hang of but now that I have done it I think I can totally do it again your girl has a lot of colostrum honestly I think I got like nine mils I would have had so I think this eight in the syringe that I got I would have had more but I kept spilling it <laughs> um but yeah, I'm tired. I've had a big day. My room's so messy because I've just been doing so much organizing and Christmas is around the corner and oh my gosh, so much is going on. But I'm so happy. I do not know why you guys watch my vlogs. I'm so bad at vlogging, but I'm gonna end this vlog here because it's already the next day and I'm starting a whole new vlog today. So thank you guys so much for watching today's vlog. Um, information about the birthing classes will be down in the description below. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, give it a like and comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And that's about it. Okay, bye.